Hey guys, Rusty over here, and today I'm going to be showing you how you can gear up a character, whether it's an alt or your main character, if you're just coming back for the Shadowlands pre-patch during the actual Scourge Invasion, the pre-patch event. Now this gear, most of it is going to be around item level 100, which is equivalent to normal Nihilotha gear, some pieces being item level 110, normal Carapace, normal Nazoth level, and a few weapons that drop from the world boss that will be item level 115, equivalent to heroic Nihilotha item level. Now this gear should give you a leg up during the Shadowlands expansion as this gear is usually mostly better than the Bastion starting zone. Basically the first zone that you go in, this gear will be better for your first few levels that you're in that zone. So with that being said, let's get right into it. Now first things first, as soon as you log into whichever character you want to gear, you'll get an introduction quest. Keep following and complete that quest line until you eventually end up in Ice Crown with the Argument Tournament quest. You're going to get one quest that will eventually unlock the dailies for you. You will have three initial dailies, basically those will give you the Argent Commendations, which is the currency that you will use to buy the item level 100 gear. Complete those three dailies every single day. Now more dailies and more quests will unlock during the second week of the pre-patch or the pre-patch event. So when that comes out, basically guys, same thing you just did here, just complete the quest until you eventually unlock more dailies and you can do those daily quests until you eventually have the Argent Commendations. Now, once you have enough Argent Commendations, you're going to head over to the vendor and you can spend these Commendations for item level 100 gear. This vendor is in the Argent Tournament Grounds. There's also one in the Faction Capital Cities, which you could see during the quest line. However, the main one is on the Argent Tournament and you can spend, I believe it's 15 of these Argent Commendations to buy item level 100 gear. Weapons, rings, and trinkets are not there, but you can buy a full set of armor around item level 100. Now, the other way you could get the Argent Commendations is by collecting the Scourge Stones after you hand in the one daily quest you could continuously turn in your Scourge Stones for more Argent Commendations. Turning in 25 of the blue ones grants you 3, 25 of the green ones grants you 1. Now how do you get these Scourge Stones? Now the green ones pretty much have a chance to drop from any Scourge minion or NPC in Ice Crown so you could if you want just go and farm Scourge. However that's really inefficient in my opinion. The best way to do this is to do the rare spawn events. Now the way this works is that every 20 minutes a rare, a rare, basically a rare will spawn of an old Ice Crown or an old Wrath of the Lich King boss. Again, this is every 20 minutes. You'll basically get a yell in your in your chat box or an event in your chat box. And also, if you open your map up, there will be a skull on your map where that rare is. As soon as the rare spawns, you have about a minute grace period to get over there before it becomes active and you can kill it. You go there and you kill the rare and it drops usually around... I don't know the exact number, but I've had anywhere from 20 to 35 of the blue Scourge Stones drop. Now, these rares are also a way to get item level 110 loot. All these rares have a chance to drop item level, again, item level 110 loot, which is equivalent to normal Carapace, normal Nihilotha loot. So if you want, you can also just farm out those rares, not only for the Scourge Stones, but also for a chance at the loot, which includes they can drop rings, trinkets, even some of them dropping weapons, depending on which rare it is. You can see by just checking their loot table. Now, the other way that you could gear up a character is simply by doing the Nathanos Blightcaller weekly quest. He is a world boss, guys. If you go and look at the Eastern Plaguelands map right now, there should be the purple world quest icon there. You head over there, you could kill Nathanos, and he has a chance, well, basically he will drop item level 115 weapons, which you could use, which is a very nice item level for your alts, and these are pretty much just transmog weapons from the Dark Shore Warfront. And to be honest, guys, that's really it. I just want to make a short, sweet guide for you guys. Basically, just showing you the different methods of acquiring the Argent Commendations, which, again, are used to mainly buy that item level 100 gear. Showing you, explaining how the rare spawns work, which is, again, they, every 20 minutes, a rare spawn will spawn in Ice Crown, and you can tell where they are by the skull on the map. And they have a chance to drop, well, they will drop the blue Scourge Stones, which, again, you could turn in for the Commendations. And they also have that chance to drop the item level 110 loot. And, of course, every single week, which is only for two weeks, wow, crazy short patch now to think about it. Every, but basically the two weeks that this event is out, you could kill Nathaniel, so whichever characters you want, and chances are you will be getting item level 115 weapons from him. And that's pretty much it, guys. If you have any questions at all, feel free to leave a comment down below. I'll do my best to answer as many as I can. I do hope the guide helped you. If you liked it, hey, throw it a like. It helps me out, and it makes me smile. Subscribe to the channel if you're not subbed already, and I also do stream over on Twitch, Friday through Monday, starting at 8 Eastern Time if you're interested. I do have that information on my channel. And other than that, guys, before I go, as always, guys, guys, listen, Halo 3 is the best Halo. That is a fact. That is, th th that's it. You're allowed to have other opinions, but they are wrong. Just know that. Halo 3 is the best Halo. Until next time, guys. Bye-bye.